This is gonna be the absolute most scuffed Toho gameplay ever. And I'm living for it. I like it when when there's sweat. Well, not that there's not sweat, but when but Whoa, whoa, there's a sweat fetish now involved too. No! Dude, you're not listening to me. Definitely the major thing I need to practice if I'm going to do this is the final boss. Oh! Wait a minute, I have an idea. Oh! That's where the life pieces are. Oh no! That means no matter what, I have to survive this. No matter what, this has to be done without a bomb. Oh no! I actually have to do this spell. It doesn't matter. And then I get my last bomb. And that's the absolute latest I can delay it, too. Luckily that one's easy, but oh no. The hardest part of this is going to be doing the penultimate spell. So that's it. That's how I can get three. The penultimate spell is a hard one, and no matter what I do, I have- I basically have to no bomb it. Like, I can't afford to use a bomb on it. <gasps> I- unless, unless I can get there with my trans- If I can get there with the tra full trans meter, we're in business. <gasps> Whatever we do, we have to- we have to be- we have to understand the spell. And we have to be able to do it, I would say, with one miss, at least. One miss or two miss. But oh my god. You won't catch me doing this on anything other than normal difficulty, that's for sure. Because I'd be like, dude, this is basic- this is the second to last thing. No matter what I do, no matter what kind of, like, bomb strategies I do, I'm always going to end up having to get here with, like, two bombs, right? I don't know how much I need to practice this to get to a point where I can, uh be comfortable with it, but we're gonna- we're basically gonna have to, like, get so comfortable with this spell that I can- I- I can- I can do it without- without feeling worried. I almost have to- I- I almost want to say, like, my only- the- my only hope is to get here with, like, a transmitter. I would- I need trans for this. If I'm gonna do this in a run. Holy shit, dude. This game literally just turned from like, oh, it's one of the easiest games to, okay, actually, it's gonna be like one of the hardest games because of one spell. Okay, one capture, let's go. That, this is, I was thinking that I could just go for it, but now that I'm looking at what I'm having, to, what I have to deal with, I now realize that no, this is gonna be a much bigger challenge than I was imagining. You're moving too much, I am moving, I don't think I'm moving enough, to be honest. Because the problem is I keep getting trapped. See right here? Because I didn't move enough, I ended up getting trapped. So I, that's definitely not it. Oh, I was so close, dude! The laser was about to hit me. If I went to the left, I would have been trapped. If I went to the right, then I was going to get clapped. What to do, dude? I'm, I'm noticing my openings too slowly. It's a very common occurrence. I think that's my main issue with this with this spell, is I'm not seeing the gaps quickly enough. The other issue is because I'm using Yomu, I am forced to move, because otherwise I can't just sit in one spot with focus all day, because she doesn't shoot when I'm not moving. If I'm focusing to make sure that I'm dodging and everything's not touching my hitboxes, then as you can see, like, she's not doing any damage. So like, it's easy to like do that, but then you're not doing any damage, like see? And then the spell lasts too long. So you have to move! It's, uh, it's uh, you have no choice. 
I wish I was. I wish I could unfocus dodge. I, that that's just pure luck right there. That there was no skill involved in that whatsoever. That was absolutely pure luck. And I'm just dead here, probably. You see, I'm not doing any damage when I'm just when I'm focusing on making sure nothing's hitting my hitbox. Oh. Finally! Oh my god! <sighs> How many? I, I I should probably go for like a hundred captures. That's what I'm thinking, honestly. If 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 the if I want this alt ending, which I do. Because otherwise, you're not really beating the game. That is my opinion. If you don't get all the endings, you're not really beating the game. You're, you're, you're just... You're only seeing one-eighth of the game. So... <laughs> no wonder Zoom made, the, made this game so easy. Because he, 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 he knew he was gonna throw this at you. My lord. People who said this game was easy, they, they're on crack. If you didn't beat the game on Lunatic, you didn't actually beat the game? Nah, 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 nah. Nah, dude. Lunatic is just higher difficulty. The normal difficulty is for normal people. If I want to have consistency, I need to be able to get through this despite the worst RNG. And I can't depend on good RNG. Do you think I'll be able to do this consistently after 100 captures? I don't even think 100 captures is going to be enough. I think I'm going to get 100 captures and it's all going to be luck. Guys, if there's a safe spot for this, let me know right now. Let me know right now and we'll start attempting, uh, we'll start attempting the run. He screams a lot when he gets killed issued? Mm hey now! Hey! Hey now, let's let's not. What if I just go for some? Can I wait? Oh god! I was just about to say, what if I just time out the spell? Like, just go for survival. Like, is it easier to survive in the corners? But I just realized, if my goal is to get my third bomb piece right after this spell, then I can't. I have to. I actually have to beat the spell. Because if I don't beat this, if I time it out, I don't get the bomb piece. Oh, dude. So I'm fucked. I, I, there's, there's no easy way to do this. There, there's, there's really just no easy way to do this. At least the hitboxes on these cards are pretty lenient. Guys, I want you to remember that I said that, alright? Clip it, alright? Remember that I said that the hitboxes on these cards are lenient. So if I later try to say that the hitboxes on these cards are BS, you know I'm spouting nonsense. <laughs> and you know that I'm just tilted. <laughs> oh. oh my gosh, be a matter of time. What? Gray things is mostly dangerous. The gray cards? Oh my god. And then they speed up, yeah? So I guess, yeah. I'm just gonna go for survival here. Oh my god. I need to go to the center. Okay. Cool. Maybe that's my problem. I'm too scared to go to the sides because I know I'm not doing any damage. But this spell lasts so long that, like, honestly, I can afford to go to the sides and do no damage. Right? So I shouldn't- I shouldn't be so hard bent on staying under her. Oh my god, dude! <laughs> this spell is gonna be the death of me! I- I thought this wasn't going to be as bad- so bad. 
Like, I, I thought this wasn't gonna be so bad, but oh my lord. This is so much worse than I could- uh, than I imagined. Literally only because of this spell. <sighs> Fami Toho! You're here! I died! Internet sucks? Oh my goodness. <laughs> what am I doing? Family Toho. I have bad news. In order to get the alternate ending, I have to beat this game with three bombs in my inventory. Ideally, what I want to do is get to here with some amount of lives and seven out of eight bomb pieces. After I capture this spell, or not capture this spell, after I clear this spell, I will get a bomb piece. Which will put me at three bombs. No matter how many times I've died, or no matter how many bombs I've used, as long as I have two bombs when I clear this spell, and seven out of eight bomb pieces, after clearing this spell, I get three bombs. That is basically the plan. Unfortunately, I did not take into consideration the fact that this spell is a piece of goddamn shit! What the hell?! God damn it, Zoom! You're not allowed to bomb this spell! I can't bomb it! Because you get to this spell, it's the second to last spell. You can do you can bomb all of our other shit, right? Because when you get to this spell, you have to do it with no bombs. You, you have to. You have no choice. Because there's no other way to make it to the last to, to the last spell with, with three bombs. Unless you want to be like a masochist and just no miss, no bomb, the entire boss fight, which I'm not doing. However, even if you try to be smart like I am and say, alright, I'm gonna cheese it, I'm gonna use bombs for everything until absolutely necessary, there's no getting around this. You have to do this without bombs. There, there's no getting around this. If you time out this spell, you don't get the extra bomb piece either. So I have no choice but to clear it. Like, I have to actually wheel down a health bar. So I can stay in corners and, and do for things. I don't know, I have to stay around and do damage and make sure I can. And so that's where I'm at. So we're gonna practice this a hundred- we're, we're gonna practice this until I capture it a hundred times. That's what's gonna happen. That's what you're about to witness me doing. <laughs> Only this spell. I'm going to be the master of this spell on normal difficulty by the time we're done. And I don't even know if that's gonna be enough. <laughs> Black dude, what's up? Yes. Hello. Hello. <laughs> okay, here's here's a for your first tip for the fights. Go to the to the largest gap, to the largest uh, lane, you know. Okay. Go, go for the fittest one. Now I'm not doing any damage though. Yeah, buddy, you're gonna die if you go to the fittest one. And I. That, that's basically it. You don't need to just go way out there in the middle, but just always go to the largest lane. That, that'll make it way safer. You, you can stay close to the laser, just don't get too close to... Just don't get railed back into a bit lane, because otherwise you get more chance to be walled. Okay. This is a fine lane. Well, remember that I'll have some amount of, you know, stream delay. Oh no. I didn't see that in time. I didn't want to be here, but I guess I have to live with it now. Hey, if you get caught on a spinner lane, it sucks, but, you know, just try not to get caught into it next time. Okay, alright. I also don't really have an idea of, like, how quickly Yomu can actually capture the spell versus how much time I have. Uh, have for what? To capture the spell. Because I can't time out the spell. <laughs> oh, you're not gonna time out, don't worry. Okay. This spell is 70 seconds long, don't worry, it will never time out. I'll never t- okay. <laughs> Like, if you are on one power and barely getting any hits in, maybe, but at three or four power, you're not gonna find this out, especially not with Yomu. You probably wouldn't find this out with Sanai, and she barely deals any damage. Alright. And the 
this is an EOS where the timers are super short. Uh, honestly, maybe don't even bother with the unfocus shot that much. I'm, I'm, not, I'm not great with the old move, What? But I know that you can basically mostly compensate with the focus damage. Really? Alright, all right, I'll try, we'll, we'll see. Well, she absolutely shreds with the focus damage, like, she takes away, like, a sixth of her health with one, sh one focus burst. Like, Yolo is super, super high damage in this game. Yeah. Well, in this and we'll about where she also has this shot. That was a nice micro, but then you overshot it. Also, why is this one so important? Can't you compensate with the other ones? Because this is the hardest spell in the game. Uh, it, this is the second to last spell in the game, so no matter what I do with my routing, I always have to do this right before the final spell. Yeah, but, but then so what? What about it? I have to do this without getting hit. Like, I can't use bombs on this spell. Yeah, but then take the death, kinda like a no bomb run. Like, just presume you will die to this. That's true, but I, I'm, I'm, that's why I'm practicing it as if I don't have bombs, but like I'm trying to capture it. So that, like, in an actual run, I'm, I'll have lives, obviously, and I'll be able to take, like, one or two deaths, ideally. Realistically, you won't die twice to this, I don't think. Especially not if you end up using your... Using your trance here, you'll end up destroying this. I'll just die once. Oh no! Oh, I'm dead. <laughs> My... I'm too slow at seeing what lanes are big and what lanes are small. Hi! Hi! Oh! My cat bit me in the freaking shoulder for no reason. <laughs> oh, the cat love bites. Oh shit! Oh gosh. I don't know how to survive that. I'm sure I'm sure every Toe player said that at least like a hundred times. <laughs> yeah. How are you doing the rest of the fight? How's that coming along? Uh, how, how, what's a comfortable base in Tamiko for the no bomb here? Or one bomb, I guess, in your plan? Um, it really doesn't matter. So ideally, we make it to Miko with like three or four lives. Okay, ideally four. I'm not gonna expect to make it to her with five. I think that's unrealistic. So like, three or four lives is probably what I'm looking at. And then... The, I, the, the plan is to get to seven bomb pieces at some point and then stop collecting them until the very end. So that we so that after capturing this spell, the one I'm practicing now, I get the last bomb piece and that puts me at three bombs, preferably after I yep, obviously after I've died. If it looks like I'm gonna capture this when I haven't died, then I'm just gonna take an intentional death. Right? So to put me at three bombs. So, that's... The uh, Kevin, Kevin, uh, you, you do get bomb pieces even if you don't capture. Uh, his only concern, which is not really realistic, is that he won't get one if he times out. But he won't time it out. Anyway, continue. Yeah, so, basically, the entire rest of the fight, I can use as many bombs as I want. The only, like, if I, it's just that when I get to this spell... I need to make sure that if I if I'm not at two bombs, I need to take an intentional death before picking up the last bomb piece. It's kind of convoluted, but uh, as long as it works, it I'm yeah. Down for it. <laughs> What's Wait, preventing him from attempt. using bombs here? Yeah, so it's like it's like three seconds. So actually, it's not that bad. I probably could work with that. But that'd be scary. For sure. Ah. That's an idea. But scary. But an idea. I'm no good at Yom, but that's why I don't really use her. Hmm. I mean, I'm an USD one-trick pony anyway. 
Well, USD and POFV. Hey, I love watching you play EOSD, man. It makes me want to play EOSD. <laughs> That's good. EOSD is good. I kind of want- it makes me want to- I mean, at some point I need to do Flandre again anyway, because I don't have the recording of it, I lost the replay to. But like, but yeah, like, also, I don't know, I feel like I could ha I I also feel like I could handle it on hard as well, you know? Probably. It's a pretty nice hard. It's just not a nice lunatic. Well... USD lunatic is jank incarnate. Really? <laughs> Absolutely. Thanks for the follow, ShinoBG. Haven't, you haven't touched USD or, or any of them for yourself in a while? And you never beat Flan? Yeah, Flan was my first extra clear. I never... Uh, I've only... The only extras I've beaten is Flandra and Sawako. I've been thinking about what my next extra will be, and I think my next extra is probably... I was thinking it might... I might go to Perfect Trade. I, either I'm gonna go back and do Flandra again, just so that I can have a replay and so that I can have a recording of it, or... I'm gonna do, uh, just, especially since it's, it should be easy because I've already done it once before, so I can obviously do it again. Knock on wood. QED, uh, I, I had a uh, DKO on QED. It was pretty rough. <laughs> QED is pretty easy if you don't have to capture it. <laughs> like, I, uh, cause... Same, same thing as Swako Final, if you don't have to capture it, you just bomb it when you get stupid. Yeah, the thing is, is that by the, like, by the time I get to QED, I've eaten through most of my resources. So I'm looking at, like, probably, like, my last life. So two bomb QED. And I, and you know I suck, so. <laughs> well, I, I suppose that you watch my USD extra stream so much, but you at least understand how to do some of the spells now. Yeah, yeah. I'm lucky that this one is easy, I say, with a 1 out of 10 cap trade. Easy once you told me how to dodge it. Which one? The Defiance? No, the... The, uh... The this, final? The final. Oh, but I can't practice this properly. Because it's, uh... Yeah. Because she's higher than than she is in the actual spell. Oh, does it make that much of a difference? Probably not. Does it for you? I think I argued that it wouldn't make that much of a difference. But I don't know. I don't think I need to practice it anyway because it's not it's not something I'm worried about. Oh, <sighs> also Shinobuji, I don't know if you're aware, but I've already got the 1cc for this game. We're trying to- I want to get the second ending, so we're trying to practice in a way that- we're, I'm trying to figure out how to beat this while with three bombs in my inventory so that I can get the second ending. at the stage again. Maybe I didn't look at it good enough. No, that's stage five. You don't. Come on. <laughs> oh, it's just the final fairies, not these. Oh, only the final fairies? Yeah, only the last batch of fairies. The, the other ones don't count. It's pretty obvious which is the last one because they come from different places. Yeah, if they if they're dropping bombs, then it's a. 
semi-final wave. Well. All right, so here's the idea, the, the basic idea. Let's see how well I can execute it. Yeah. Let's see how many lives this burns through. So, like, obviously, I can use bombs right now. But... That first one is simple. I don't think you'll die to this. This one is, is not the first spell is not too easy, but it's not massively complicated either. Uh, the second spell is the close shit, right? I don't know how to do that. Oh too shit! Well. I accidentally died. That's unfortunate. I ran into a bullet that was behind me. I see that, yes. This yeah, should be free, but the, uh, the, the, uh, yeah, the hitboxes on this are kind of unforgiving. Oh, well, it's more because it's glow shit, and glow shit sucks. method for this, I just kind of dodge. I probably... I don't... It seems... It's, it's easy enough on normal mode, so I guess I can get away with it, but... Yeah. You don't really need much fancy stuff on normal for this. How, why did my bomb not go through? Dude. On Lunatic, you'd be wise to consider some strategy for it, but... No. Anyway, uh, give me a sec. I'm sure you'll do fine. bad patterns on this. Cool. Alright, I'm, I'm good on this. Eternal Meat 2.0, let's go. Okay. And I don't I don't grab it because I'm at seven. I'm at seven. Alright, here we go. This spell. I can use bombs. Well no I can't. I can't use bombs. If I if I have to, I should test that out. That theory at some point, but I want to see what a run would look like. So far, I've lost one life, I believe. There we go. That puts me at three. I can't believe I captured it. Holy crap.
Ooh. Okay. I just beast moded it. <laughs> I couldn't tell, but... I don't remember. <laughs> I'm gonna save a replay of that just so I can look at it. Mm. Sure. Do you know where the replays go in this game? Because they don't go in the game folder. They don't? Yeah, on, on Windows they go into uh, app data, roaming, uh, Shanghai Elise and TH13 Replay. That's where they go on Windows, so probably something similar to that on Linux. Oh my god, dude! All of them will do that from now on. Why? <laughs> I don't know, what's where they go. Three lives sounds okay, but then you have to route the entire rest of the game around this, which shouldn't be too hard. What else is complicated about the game? Are yeah. you good on Sega? Are you good on Stage Five? Uh, the, to be honest, the game when I was going for the first, my first one CC, just it kind of really felt easy. Like it's nothing compared to UFO or Subterranean Animism. Well, UFO is one of the hardest games in the series, and pattern-wise, Ten Desires might be the easiest. When you start going for, for example, a closer example to you, like my EX and Bs, uh, you kind of have to have some amount of detachment to the runs. Like, you know, sometimes they're like, whoa, wow, we're past Maze of Love and I didn't even notice because last time I paid attention was on the last attempt. You know, you kind of have to have some amount of detachment to the runs at that point. Because if you get attached to literally every single run, you're going to get disappointed every single time. Well, I don't mind getting disappointed. That's that's not that's not something that, that I, I don't I don't mind that. Yeah, but you know, it's about efficiency, you know. Like I'll get disappointed. I like it doesn't matter how disappointed I get. I'll always bounce back up and I'll try again. <laughs> It's kind, of, it's kind of like, like how you notice I don't freak out when I lose a run. It's kind of like, oh wow, this, this one died, whatever, next one. It's kind of like that. Like if I were to get like, oh no, I lost this shit! Oh, it will be like, yeah, yeah sure. I even had friends that used to be do, like, do that. And yeah, yeah, it's like Bam said. You get runs when you stop caring, kind of. Like... The, the amazing power of not actually caring about the run. It does a lot for you. <laughs> like, to a certain extent, like, I, I, I can understand the, uh... The, I can understand the... mentality, like, the, 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 why, why you would... Why you, why that's appealing, but... It's also kind of like, I don't know. It depends, it depends. I don't know if you can help but actually develop this over time if you go for high level survival stuff and scoring too, of course. Because, you know, the runs stop being special after some point and you just kind of treat them like another thing. So, you, you, you know, you, you kind of stop screaming at them because it becomes normal, you know? It's just kind of inevitable almost. It depends. What the heck was that? What? What? What did I get hit by? Hello? I don't want to take that death. I'm trying again. <laughs> okay, dude, that was entirely your fault. <laughs> what the- what, what? What do you mean that was my fault? What happened? What did I get hit by? Well, you get hit by- you, you, you dashed against the bullets. There were only four of them. Where? <laughs> like... Where in front of you? <laughs> Sorry, but you got him. <laughs> you just kinda bowed him to the And see like dude like like that that that's the that's not even something I should be mad about. Like that's that's only stage two. Like I that, I have no reason to be upset about it, but it's just the fact that like I literally didn't see that coming. I don't know, I'm just the type of I, I'm very easily excited. what the heck, dude? I'm very easily excitable. So I think it's it just depends on what type of person you are. And maybe 
just just by pure luck, everybody that you've seen in the Toad community is just the type of person that just gets desensitized easily. But I'm not. I don't get desensitized very easily. Oh no! I I I I've had friends in this community that they that they, they absolutely lost their freaking shit. They lost the run. Don't worry. Like I used to be friends with Ultro back in the day, and yeah, he. Sadly, he would freak out a lot. He'd laugh about it later, but you know... At the time where the run was happening, he would, he would freak out. The other thing about my freakouts is like, in the moment, like it sucks. I'm disappointed. I'm angry. Maybe. I don't know. But like... It, it usually doesn't last too long. <laughs> But, it's like, I don't know. I'm trying to find words for for it. I don't know, it's, 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 I feel like it's more exciting to live life that way. Than to just be dead to everything. But then you don't even get to enjoy your accomplishments. Yeah, but, but you think I don't enjoy my accomplishments? We'll see. We'll we'll come back in ten years. See what state my mind is in. <laughs> Maybe I'll be just like you, dead to everything. <laughs> wow, I'm dead to everything. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! Okay, I all right. I'm I'm talking and not paying attention. I. I was I went way too close to you, go. That, that's I I was about to like like be like say something irrational, but that was entirely my fault. Cause the thing is like like even now like I'm I like I'm not even attached to these runs yet. I'm not on stage four or five. I'm still getting excited when I when I uh when I die and lose a run stupidly. <laughs> I don't know, dude. Well, well she knows what she's so. Just depends on what happens. I talk about this on my stream sometimes too. You also shouldn't shouldn't completely like be. You, you also shouldn't not care about the run also too much. You know, you shouldn't be completely like oh whatever to the run because then you might start dying way too much to stupid shit. You should. You need you to. You should care about the run somewhat. There, there's, but there's not like, too much. there's like, um, you're, you're searching for like a Zen state. Well, I, if you remember my last VODD stream, you know, uh, on my layout, I said it kind of as a joke there on my layout, but it also kind of is true. It is a thing of Buddhism teaches too. Attachment is the root of all suffering, and that's true, really. I mean, are you gonna argue against that? It's just true, I think. It's. It, I mean, it's true to a degree. Attachment does lead to suffering, but it also leads to excitement. I think it's more exciting to be attached to things. Like, and and to, it's it's more exciting to have disappointment and then get your achievements. Am I a masochist? Uh, it's it's I it's it's. <laughs> I don't know. I like. I think you just found out something about yourself. No, 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 no. Listen, no, it's not. It's not like that. I mean, it's maybe a little bit. I don't know. Fuck, dude. No. I think we just found out something about you. No, it's like it's like I like it when when there's sweat. Well, not that there's not sweat, but when but. Wow, wow. There's a sweat fetish now involved too. No, dude, you're not listening to me. Or you're listening to- you're, you're taking what I'm saying out of- uh, whatever, dude. <laughs> I know what you're talking about, I'm just teasing. <laughs> I don't know, like, of course being disappointed sucks, but sometimes, like, when I look back, I like to look back at the times where I was disappointed, and it makes it a little bit more gratifying when I finally overcome the obstacle, right? Well, we're arguing the Buddhist philosophy now, too. See? Uh, Toho is also a culture. Because, you know, this game talks about Taoism. Oh! Ah! Um, okay. I... Alright. 
To be fair, that's the first time that that's happened. I don't think Yuko has ever moved up during that spell enough for that to ever happen to me. <laughs> You're hugging Yu Yuko so much, but she's so soft, I can't blame you. <laughs> Yuko is cold to the touch? Oh yeah, she's a ghost. She'd be- oh, so that means that she wouldn't be fun to hug. She'd be bad at hugs. And as you guys know, I'm too hugged because we just did that spot fast. No, no, Yuyuko's so soft. She, she would probably still be nice to hug. Imagine hugging her in a, in a like a hot day. What? <laughs> like imagine it's super hot that day. You know, maybe like the day that was uh, on Friday here. You know, the Friday where, where my my energy cable, my power cable, is caught on freaking fire. <laughs> uh, it was. It was 116 Fahrenheit outside. You might think then, I then okay, 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 I can I can see an exception I made for that, yeah. Because sometimes when you when you hug or cuddle with people, like it it there it's hot and it's and it's uncomfortable. So I can I can see that I can see that. But what am I doing? <laughs> Uh, and yes, band. of course I would hug you, Yuko, on the beach. Imagine how, how soft and nice she is. She would probably want to eat a lot, but you know, that's you, Yuko. You will have to paint quite a hefty view for her. Yuko is good. I have nothing but nice things to say about you, Yuko. She is, she's our silly, silly manipulative final boss girl you want you want to know something i i used to really like the more i play uh, like i've always loved yomu but the more i play these games and the more i i talk think about yuko the more i uh, the more i start to like yuko more <laughs> like yuko bro what is happening yomu you freaking suck <laughs> for yomu well, Yomu is super lame, but she's lame by design, so you know, you kind of root for her. <laughs> I guess. I will say, though, having a melee character in this game, in, in this style game, is kind of fun. Oh, what? I don't know what I get hit, got hit by. It's kind of fun. It's kind of fun. I wish, I wish we, they did this more often. Well, this is the final super interesting shot I can get, yeah, I guess. Well, DDC, ha <laughs> ha we're back on the topic of DDC shot types. Uh, DDC Marissa A is a pretty interesting shot type. That's all we can say about her. <laughs> She's interesting conceptually, but... Uh, uh. I can't wait to see the, how that shot type is gonna work out. I, I doubt any safe spots are intended. Probably not. Most of the safe spots you see in Toho are super convoluted. Uh, unless it's easy, which is a pretty neglected difficulty. Yeah, haha. Ha. Uh, Icicle Fall Easy has a massive safe spot. Good, do you think Zod really play tested easy? Probably not. But yeah, most of the other safe spots are mega convoluted, as you might imagine. Meek spot, you know, the safe spot on Eternal Meek, is super convoluted, and it's even lunatic exclusive because of the way the bullets spawn. It, uh, it really, really does surprise me that uh, Eternal Meek has a safe spot. That 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 is genuinely really surprising. Well, the safe spot is super hard to get to, and it's super convoluted and specific. So some people don't even use it, because it's not easy to set up. You need to practice how to get the safe spot, so at this point it's almost like... It's almost like a, like an alternative legit way of doing it, I guess. Because you need to practice the safe spot almost as much as you would practice a real one. Like, like doing it for real. Please don't, please don't step on me, Kyoko. I'm, 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 I'm allergic to feet. That's a quote and a half. <laughs> I can't believe I said that. Okay. <laughs> oh! Because Yomu doesn't have power, her shots are not reaching her. 
waste your ball. Oh, wait, I can't even take a de Oh, it's over. I can't even take a. I can't even waste a life. It's. Yeah. Oh. <sighs> GG. That's unfortunate. Oh, well. I was about to take a death so I could go to three lives, but I just realized I don't have any lives. Oh, well. I, I don't even get what happened. I think you, you, you had three bombs, didn't you? No, I, know. I know I had no. I was about to die. And so I used a bomb. I would have had three lives if I didn't use a bomb. But I was about to die. If I didn't use a bomb, I was gonna die to that spell. And so I used a I used a bomb to survive, and my thinking was, well, I still have one more life, so I'll just waste all my bombs, die, and then I will grab this last bomb piece and I'll be at three bombs. But I don't have any lives left. Uh, anyway, this was a good run. You almost got it already. I almost got it, and had I been, had I had one more life, I would have, ac I would have been able to. Let me see. I, I, if I would have been able to survive this. So there's, there's the extra life I would have been able to get. This, this spell is easy. So like, if I would have, of course, there's no pressure now. Even without pressure, I failed. So. It's whatever it happens. Mm. The, the run was good enough. Good enough for a first try with this kind of mixed thing. Yeah. As you, as, you, as you saw, you got way more bombs than you even imagined anyway. Why is Toho so hard? Um... I don't think it's it's that it's hard. I think it's just that nobody in the West really plays these this style game. So it's like so it's hard. <laughs> it's hard because you you don't you don't practice the skills necessary to do it. Also, you have to you have to change your perception. You have to remember that these games are short. They're built on the idea that you're going to be spending time practicing them and getting better at them. It's not like a, oh, I'm going to do a one playthrough I'm going to get through it my first time. It's something that you spend time with. There's only six stages in this game. Meanwhile, a lot of like Mario games that are like, you would say are easier than Toho, they're made to be played in like your first time playthrough. Maybe you die once or twice or three times, but you could just jump back. This is a, like an entire experience you're supposed to go through once. Well, not once, but you have to. You actually have to dedicate time to being able to go through all the stages in one run. So it's different. The mindset is different. Yeah, it's hard to hear you through your phone mic. Wow, it's so crunchy. <laughs> Squid Dog and Kevin, it's it's not. I just want to let you know it's not on my end. Uh, he's he's using his phone now instead of on the on the computer. So his mic is just a little. Blast you in the ears, <laughs> We're ready to begin. Are you ready to watch me get this first try? <laughs> I hope so. You're ready for screaming? There will be no screaming today. I mark my words. Today I have graduated. I will be a deadpan person, just like Fami. And I will oh, be unfazed. I'm, I'm dead, man. <laughs> I, <laughs> I will be unfazed by all that happened today. I will prove today that all my screaming is just performing clips. You're not sure about that one, Chief? I'm prove you. I'm gonna prove you wrong. I'm I'm proving you wrong, dude. I can barely hear the music. I kind of want to, I kind of, I kind of want to, it's only stage one. I can, I can boost up the music, actually. Let me boost it up. You should hear it now. <laughs> Poor fairies, they're just trying to have fun and you genocide them. What do you mean they're just trying to have fun? They're shooting- they're literally shooting bullets at me. What- what-, what? Yeah, they're excitable is all. 
They Okay, alright, we'll see if that holds up in the court of law when I when I when I shoot somebody in real life. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, but it's getting so cute. That's how people read each other, they just shoot. <laughs> Yeah, it's, it's a lawless land. Ah, <laughs> uh, that's the problem, they got no lawyers. The music is still kind of quiet, dude. People say hi to you and you pull out your gun? What the heck? America! Yeah, that sounds America! exactly like America. <laughs> no, no. Yuko, look, this is, this is Yomu, you don't want to kill her. I mean, she's already half dead. I think that's how it works. <laughs> but you don't want to make her fully dead. Oh, Yuyuko would never kill Yomu. Who's going to cook for her then? Oh, that's true. Although, although, would it make a difference? Because Yomu would just, uh, would would just end up back back in Hakugyokuro. Uh, yeah, maybe. But you know, a little spirit isn't gonna cook for her. Maybe, kinda. I don't know how it's, how it works. I don't, I don't know if Don Maku can even kill you. Well, Don Maku must be able to kill you if, uh, if, cause I mean, we defeated, Yuko is a full spirit, right? And we defeated her in Perfect Cherry Blossom. Yeah, she's a ghost, ooh. Soft, lush ghost lady. Wow, he do be a potty mouth? What, who's a potty mouth? Me or Fanny? Party mouth. Who are you talking about, Squid Dog? What the heck? I just, I just, I, I just sang, sang this, this stupid America song, and then I called you, you go soft and cuddly. Yeah. What? 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 <laughs> Bro, smoking that good stuff. Why, why am I a potty mouth? What did I say? I just sang the stupid America song. Yeah, the guy with me is um is a uh, Fami. He's another Toho streamer. He's uh Family Team Toho is his actual full YouTube uh, not YouTube Twitch channel. Yeah, but it's my full legal name, Family Team Toho. <laughs> <laughs> yes, that's what that's what's written on his ID card. Yes, that's me, Odyssey. Family team. Oh! Yeah. Ah! Oh. What happened? It's like a, a cockroach climbed on your leg. You're about to see what happened in like two seconds. <laughs> yeah, I see. I was I was farming spirits and uh, and then she got me. Family team TH. Yes, I said family team Toho, as if you know what the acronym is, even though you're not like. Technically, like a Toho fan, like us. But why is your PFP a girl, bro? My my Discord PFP is a girl. What, what what's your point? I I think they mean my PFP. Uh, why not? It's, it's 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 an OC of mine. Oh, it's an OC. Oh, cool. My Discord profile picture is uh. What you call it, is is um Kurumi from No Game No Life? That's really unfortunate. <laughs> unfortunate? No, not Why? not I my pro not my profile picture. The fact that I just died. You're about to see it. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> uh, I, it, it's really dangerous up at the top of the screen. This is one of the things that I. Some of these gimmicks are just. If I had one complaint, it's not. I will say it's not nearly as bad as UFO, but it's still pretty. It's still pretty hazardous, the fact that the whole gameplay mechanic in this game revolves around you staying at the top of the screen. It's, uh... Well, UFO is peak invasive gimmick, but... Uh... But... TD has a rougher early game than UFO has. Enemies spawning on top of you, bullets getting shot in your face. I kind of wish that they provided more more enemies to get to get uh, spirit points from. That way, I wouldn't have to hug the top of the screen quite so much. Apparently, your your spirit gathering stuff is half for normal and easy, so you know it would be enough on hard and lunatic. Seriously, why? That's just so weird. 
Like, I can understand for points, but like, that that affects like so much. Like, it's I mean, it wouldn't even be the first point-related thing that's affected by difficulty. Not at all. Well, yeah, like, e ever, even in EOSD, like, you get a multiplier for the, um, what difficulty you finish it in, right? Yes, but the point item value is different for difficulty, too. 50,000 on easy, 100,000 on normal, 150,000... Wait, it's 200,000 for extra... Well, whatever, you get what I mean. It's the, the point item value is different for each difficulty too. Happens to the best of us. When I die to the stage one boss, it humbles me. It reminds me just how much I suck at this game. You blame me for lagging your game and making you get hit? How does that work, bro? Underage girls? I don't think there's a single underage girl in Protocol. Like, Yobu is a working age adult. Poor, poor girl, she works so much. I guess the closest thing would probably be like, Romelia and Flandra and they're vampires, so they're like, thousands of years old. I, I guess Cherno is basically a child. Yeah, okay, I is... forgot about the fairies, so... <laughs> basically them, but, but if you think about it, for example, if Mystia is supposed to be roughly the same physical age as them, Mystia has a job, two of them. Squid Dog just said he's playing some mobile version of Toho. <laughs> Uh-oh. <laughs> some mobile version of Toho. Oh, I, I can't imagine what that is. There there are some fan games of that are shmup on mobile. Oh really? Or it's not mobile. Yeah, there there are some fan games. How would you play a shmup on uh, on your on your phone? Hello, that you, sounds you, awful. You, you you drag the character around. Oh God, no! Thank you. Holy crap, that sounds awful. I had the idea of maybe playing on a dance pad, but man, dude. I think there was someone who played it on bongos once. You know what I wish this game had? I wish you could cancel your trans mode after you use it. So that you didn't have to use the whole thing. Dude, why don't- how, I don't know what I got hit by, but... I just died to stage two. This is so ridiculous, dude. So much for me doing this first try. Get to level at- You know, I'm just gonna- I'm just gonna stay far away from her. I don't wanna get got by these bullets. Not worth it. If you want to be very funny, you can headset her. And then move away when, you know, she breaks the little thing. I have enough spirits that I don't think I need to, uh, I don't think I need to grind anymore. Yo! First time making it past stage 2, let's go! I can actually, like, <laughs> enjoy myself now. Ooh, enjoy yourself. This is where the game actually gets fun. I don't remember where I used the, uh, trans in this stage, but... I think I used it's it immediately. It's generally obvious when you're supposed to use it. I'll just use it here. I don't know if that was a good use of it, but I used it. There are resources, and so I used it. <laughs> and it's I good enough. Yeah. I don't. I. I. It's. I'm not gonna make it to the my. Uh, 18 life. It's fine. I just realized Kogasa doesn't even have a spell in this. Does she? No. I don't think she does in higher difficulties either. I don't remember. That's so sad. Probably not. Woo! They almost spawned on top of me, yo. We made it through the stage without dying. This is very good. This is very good. I don't use- I don't like using a bomb there, but oh well. I'm not gonna risk it, it's not worth it. Oh, I defeated her anyway, wow. There goes that Yomu charge slash damage, holy crap, dude. <laughs> Yo, we got a run going, we made it to stage four. This could be it. Yes. 
gasp. You're not even excited. See, this is what I mean. You're deadpan. Can't even get excited about runs anymore because they're it, un until the run is until it's the one. You don't. It's. It, <laughs> No, that's not- I hit C! I hit the C button! God dang it, dude! I don't know what why you used a bomb when I pressed C. <clears throat> Did you fat finger him? I'm- I- I guess! There needs to be a failsafe for that. To what? To having a fat finger? No, like, you should be able to override a bomb by pressing C. So that your transmitter, your trans gets used instead of your bomb. Ridiculous. Uh, I, I don't know, man. <laughs> How would that work? I don't know. After you really press, good. after you press X, you can press C after like half a second to cancel the bomb. Get your bomb back and use trans instead. Uh, half a second is a long time. So if you accidentally hit both bomb and trans at the same time, like fat fingering it. Then you tr then it prioritizes trans. Skill issue. How is that a skill issue, dude? Also, why can't I use a bomb and trans at the same time? For like double it's damage. It's a waste. It's a waste. It's a waste, but I should be allowed to do it. <laughs> if you want your damn American freedom to waste my resources. Yes. I won't waste my bomb and my trans and the government can't stop me. Ah, uh, that's unfortunate. I used all my bombs in that fight, dude. But at least I didn't lose a life. Yo, I just realized this is stage 5 already. I've just kind of been vibing, dude. Yo! Oh. See, see, someday you will stop screaming at runs, too. I don't know. We'll see. <laughs> Can the boat hit you? I just, I just want to ask that. Can the what? Can the, the boat? boat hit you? I, I don't know. I never tried it. Well, I'm I I, I, I'm not now. I'm not gonna try it, but like that's something I would like to know. That would be good to know. Don't don't go and kiss uh, the little cow girl. Don't. She's very huggable and, and tiny and cute, but don't don't hug me. Don't. She she has contact poison like every boss, except Biakren. She she lets you hug her just fine because Biakren is nice and wholesome. Perfect! Alright, look at this! Five lives into stage... into stage six! We got Yay. this, boys! We got no this! Miss. No <laughs> miss. Ha has this been a no-miss run so far? Have I not gotten yeah. hit a single time? It's no miss. Oh my goodness. Unfortunately, I have to... I have to miss because... I can't get to three bombs any other way. <laughs> Alright, why are you saying that like this isn't 10 desires? Okay, true, true. However, this is where it actually matters because now for is the hard part. I have to beat Nico with three bombs in my in my pocket. So <laughs> wish me luck. It looks like we're we're also gonna get our sixth life as well. So hey. We are this this is this is the best run that I've ever had. <laughs> Yo, sure. Let's see. Just we're only remember in... to get your bomb. 
Yeah, make sure I get my bomb. So we are at uh, five lives. We're gonna get our sixth life, and so yeah, this will be. This is perfect. It's if it's if it's gonna happen, it's gonna happen now. It's gotta happen now. Whew. And hey, I'm only an hour in, so that means I have enough time to do Reimu runs as well. Wish me luck, Femi. <laughs> All right. Sure, just just b route your bomb properly. I don't know how you're gonna do it. Unfortunately, I don't have any bombs to start, or maybe fortunately, because we know that I suck at using them. So. I used my trance and it it didn't work. I mean it's working now, but it didn't work when I pressed C. That sucks. But whatever. Because you apparently did not have full trance. You, you <gasps> no, it did step. work. You can death trans. Oh my god! Just like you can death bomb, you can actually death trans. I just learned that. Holy crap! I had no idea that was a thing! The sound effect played for me dying, but I actually was able to get the trans mode off and I didn't die afterwards. That's yeah, good. Anyway, remember to die before you actually get your final bomb piece, I guess. Yeah, so I'm at four, so I need to make sure. I'm at five now. Yeah, I have to keep track of that. I don't know, maybe die before. Just be safe, I guess. I don't think you're going to six miss Miko. Well, don't don't underestimate how much I suck at this game. It would be pretty impressive if you did. Yo, are you trying to say that? Are you trying to tell me something, dude? What What are you trying to say about me, man? <laughs> uh, I believe I believe you won't six miss into Miko. If you did, I would be very surprised. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so you're you're saying that you have faith that I'm good enough to not 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 uh six miss Nico. That's what you're saying. Yes. I mean, it would be pretty hard to six miss her. She doesn't even have six things that are hard. True. I'm probably gonna take a death here though. And that's fine. Somehow I didn't. But it's oh, not sure. where we die are. on the next phase, then, Oh my goodness. I always die to this, though. The washing machine. Oh, okay. There's my death. Good. Yeah, you did it. Okay. We're at seven. I could just bomb this. Or I could capture it. Just capture it, dude. Don't don't like be funny about it. If you die, it's whatever. If I capture you it, have. I have to no miss everything else, which is what I'm going for. All right, everything else has to be a no miss. Here we go. This is it. If you die with three bombs, you. Well, I mean, I'm sorry. Everything. Uh, I have to do this five miss. This has to be a five miss. And there's- okay, well, that's unfortunate. Okay. Please, nothing funny. No! What? What? What happened? Did, why did you press the bomb button? It was a reaction! Oh. Reconnection successful, okay. We're back. <laughs> <sighs> the rage quit off the ages. Oh my god. The oh, funny thing is, him. the funny thing is, is that only you were able to witness my reaction to 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 that stupidity, Fami.
<laughs> Get the dude. The dude. The dude jerked for the bomb butt and then jerked for the rage. <laughs> Holy crap. Dude has no, no bomb blood in him whatsoever. Dude! Dude, what the fuck, dude? That was stupid! It oh. was easier to not press the bomb button than it would be to press it. You did you did miss a scream, but it wasn't it wasn't like a super loud one. It was uh So okay, let me explain what happened, alright? I don't know how much of that actually showed on this on, on stream, but let me explain. I can tell you what, how much showed you pre you pre you bombed it and then like a second later the screen went went kaput. <laughs> <laughs> oh okay. All right. So what happened was I pressed I I pressed bomb right before I died. I because I you know which I wasn't supposed to do because I have three I have to pocket three bombs for to get the alternate ending. And I was so I don't know what was going on. I it, it I was so like BRB. I, I I I tried to hit escape. I tried to pause just out of pure shock that I that I that I bombed out of pure reaction, because like I I, I mean, that's not what I was supposed. I I was so used to bombing. I cannot believe I lost a run to that. That's so that is so tragic. And the worst part is there's nothing I can do. I can't I can't recover from that. There's there's nothing I can do at this point. The run's dead. Instead of hitting escape, I hit the power button. You said you were gonna prove me wrong? Dude, I'm glad I'm not, like, one of those streamers that have, like, TTS. Because, like, if I did, everybody would be dunking on me right now. I'm so sad that I have to reset now. After- after getting so close. That was such a good run, too. That was literally no miss up to stage 6. I did not take a death the entire... I, I didn't take a death the entire game. Until, until Miko. If I ever do no miss run, no miss, no bomb. Like if I ever do no bomb runs of, the, of any game, I'm freaking disabling the bomb button. I just know that I'm going to hit that bomb button on accident. <laughs> It's just, it's just pure instinct, dude. How can you, how can you see your death coming and not hit the bomb button? Oh my gosh, dude. Hello, yes, you, you, you just tried to dodge through it. Dude, I'm glad Glimmer wasn't here. He'd be laughing his ass off. <laughs> you can get the run again. Like, even if you do or three miss into stage six, you saw that it's entirely possible. Well, yeah, I'm definitely skilled enough to make it there. It's just now I I have to do it again. Basically, have I I guarantee you I, that would have been the run if I just didn't press bomb. And it's so stupid because it's like, it, you know how like you you were talking or, uh, to me like before about how like when you do element um L M N M B L L N L N M N B. Yes, L N N. When you're doing LNNs and you and then you try to do go back to doing regular runs, you have to get you have to remember how to bomb. I'm having the opposite problem. I have to remember to not bomb. <laughs> that was not a mistake that I thought I was gonna make. Like that was I did not think that that was something I would have to worry about. Now I'm gonna be afraid that that's gonna happen again. Anyway, I don't know why you're in the rush to finish TD because DDC is next. DDC these nuts? Is DDC like a bad game? Well, lots of people don't like it, and even if you do like it, the shot balance is the worst in the series. Can't wait for that. Maybe I should do an extra stage before tackling DDC then. If I'm if, if I'm gonna do another uh, another extra stage, it's probably gonna be Perfect Cherry Blossom. I'm thinking. Think about it like this: DDC is not an easy game, but. The overpowered shots are so stupid overpowered that they managed to trivialize it. But the bad shots are so bad that they managed to make the game even freaking worse. Really? That's 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 how it is? 
So DDC yeah. is genuinely like it's it's a pretty tough game, but the best shot types are super overpowered, and the worst shot types are absolutely awful. Yes, that's DDC. Is this aimed? Uh oh, wait a minute. I just I think I just discovered something. <gasps> it's this is aimed. Oh my god, I just had a revelation. I mean, it lasts such a short you amount didn't of time. Know? No, I didn't know. I just now learned that. Ah! She stepped on me! I told you I was allergic! Oh! <laughs> Holy crap, every single time you do these, I think a spider crawls in your leg. <laughs> Dude, the thing about these the, uh, about these screams is like it's not even because I'm attached to the run yet. That was only stage two. It's 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 just because it's so shocking. You don't expect to die to that. <laughs> Maybe that's also another difference because like you at in order to do a LNN, you have to have so much knowledge about about the stage in the game, right? So you wouldn't be caught off guard when you buy something like that. You would you would know what happened. I just learned something else about Yudko. This is something that I, again I I'm, I'm no, the the number of times I'm having to replay these first two stages. It's funny I haven't even played I haven't even gone to the other shot types yet, and I'm already and I'm already learning a lot. But the uh, the um, Yuko with all of Yuko's nons have a pattern. They go, she shoots twice, then she moves. Then she shoots three times, then she moves. Then she shoots four times, then she moves. And then it keeps going. So as time progresses, the, the, the screen gets progressively more filled with bullets. You had a power outage? Don't worry, man. You didn't miss, well, actually, no, you did miss something. You, you did miss something. <laughs> You you missed me getting stepped on by Kyoko, and you also missed um, you missed me losing a run to use to using a bomb, and then hitting the power button on my computer out of out of out of shock. It was definitely out of shock and not out of rage. But... Yeah, I wasn't mad. It was it was out of shock, dude, guys. Uh oh, there's lightning outside my house. Dude, am I going to get a power outage in addition to all of this? Dude, that would be ridiculous. And kind of hilarious. Dude, I yeah, like literally I just saw I just saw lightning strike out my house. It's still far away. But like like I don't hear the thunder, but that would be the cherry on top. Yeah, maybe the universe just really doesn't want me to to get this run, dude. Scoring for this game must be interesting. Instead of going for lives and everything, you have to find the spots where there's lots of blue crap, yeah? Uh, scoring in TV looks funny, you dodge nothing. What?! <laughs> you, end up, you, you end up stacking... You end up kind of stacking trans on top of each other, so you you spent a lot of the game under trans. Wait, you, <laughs> so you you basically never leave trans mode? Is that what I'm hearing? I think it's something like that. Yes. Please don't step on me again. I'm telling I'm, I'm telling you, Kyoko. Listen, listen. Oh my god! Dude! Okay, please don't what? shoot me either, alright? Jeez! Yes, I'm gonna- I'm, Okay, listen, listen, alright? Dude! Oh my god! Every single time she steps on me, or every single time she freaking, like, shoots me in the face, or more accurately, shoots me from the freaking side because she bounces something off of a barrier she put on, you know, the, you know, so I'm not even looking at it for whatever reason because I'm just not paying attention, or I don't even know, some kind of skill issue thing, alright? And then I scream off the top of my lungs louder than Kyoko could ever hope and dream. Dude, I cannot believe how many times I've died to that. That is like, what, the third time? What is wrong with me? Stop risking it so much, it's okay. No, I need these resources, dude! <laughs> dude is a freaking addict, it's like it's cocaine. <laughs> like, dude, like, I just don't, like, it's not even, it shouldn't even be that hard. Like, 
I, because it's not even the bullets that she's shooting directly in front of my face that's hitting me. It's like literally a bullet that's been on the screen for like 10 seconds. <laughs> like, like a bullet that I should have seen coming from like a mile away. Like, I could understand if she shot me in the face. Like, because cause then it'd be like, oh, I didn't see that. I, my reaction time was slow. But I have, that was, I had no excuse for that. that. There was literally no excuse for that one. Like, what do I say to that? Like, how do I, how do I prevent that? I just improve my vision, I guess. My, improve my awareness. I don't know, dude. <laughs> Ridiculous. Now I have to beat Yomu up- uh, not Yomu. I have to beat up Yuyuko again. Yomu's gonna have to beat up y Yuyuko, like, so many times. <laughs> Poor Yuyuko. She's a big lady. The bullets just bounce right off her belly. Sorry for going on a bit of a tangent there, but... I don't know. It just, yeah, you, just... Went, you did hate speech. <laughs> I just- I just- I don't know, dude. Like, that- it's get it's starting to get under my skin the fact that I've died to that so many times. There's no reason for it. I shouldn't be so amped up. It's only an hour thirty minutes in. My U my UFO runs uh, took like five hours to get a one CC. So I'm like, I shouldn't I shouldn't be so amped up quite yet. <laughs> but I I don't know. It's just the, the stage two madness, dude. <laughs> Maybe today's an off day. Well, no, it's it's clearly not. I was about to say maybe I'm just having an off day. This is like not a not a day where I'm where I'm ha being good at toe. But I literally just had a run where I was beyond pace to succeed. Maybe that's why I'm so amped up. I I should already be done. <laughs> and I lost a run to using a bomb when I when I shouldn't have used it. I had five freaking lives. I had five lives, and I wasted a bomb. That's a funny statement, too. Five lives, and I had to reset because I wasted a bomb. If this isn't the run, I'm gonna take a short break. Maybe grab a, grab a drink. And actually, no, I have a drink right here. What am I saying? Yeah, grab a drink for all the screaming you do. I don't scream that much. I only scream like maybe once or twice a stream, right? Sure. What is what do you mean sure? Have you been counting? I'm sure it's like once or twice a stream only. It's I, very I rare. It's very rare. Sure Alright. already stream more than twice to this. WHAT IS HAPPENING?! Okay, I'm, t I'm taking a break. There, <laughs> 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 my point has been made for me. Alright. I'm back. Did you get your throat medicine? My what? <laughs> medicine for your throat that you just ripped right out of your neck? No, my my voice is fine. I got some food though. I got some fried rice. We're two hours in at this point, I think. Right? I think it's about time that we actually get a run with how easy this is supposed to be. How difficult would you say this, sh this, this, th what I'm trying to do is? You almost got it, dude. <laughs> I would have gotten it if I didn't use the bomb, dude. That's the- that's... Yeah, grow a brain. Dude. Oh, next time, also play on Lunatic Ultra Patch. Ultra Patch? What, what is that? Yeah, some people do joke patches where they take lunatic and just double the bullet slumau. Oh my god, that's <laughs> that's so basically like EOSD, but instead of rank thirty two, it's like rank sixty four. Rank mostly for most of the spells just makes the spells faster, kinda sort of maybe. Rank is funny. Hmm. I just hit my foot in a funny way. Instant karma. Ow. <laughs> Ow. 
instant karma for being silly. Yesterday, when I was setting up Christmas decoration, I hit my knee real bad. That's bad because I do Muay Thai, so I need my knee. Wait, you do Kick Muay Thai? In the face. Yes, and I also do BJJ and wrestling and boxing. Okay, for, okay. And I I, for a second there, I thought when you said BJ, I I I was a I, I was I thought you were gonna stop there, <laughs> and, then, and then you put the other J there, and I was like, oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, and I also do ninjutsu too. Ni ninjutsu. Yes. I do. Oh my god, that almost spawned right on top of me. Fammy's an actual honest to god ninja. Guys, I just I just wanna know. If I ignored if I didn't take so much risk, like how many resources am I actually missing? Like Do I need to play this risky? <laughs> no. You'll probably just end up with less bombs. Well, that's not good because, well, I, I kind of, I don't know. I want to get on the same pace that I did on that one run where I, where I used you a bomb. You won't get into that same pace and you also don't need it. What do you mean I won't get on the same pace? Oh, I'm going to prove you wrong now. Watch me. Yeah, well, it would be good, but it's not necessary. It's not like, oh, I didn't know Miss into Miko again. This run sucks. <laughs> okay, all right. But, like, ideally, ideally, what is it, Kevin? What? This better be good. You're going to make me run into a bullet. Last time you tried to prove someone wrong, I fucked up. Okay, sure. Whatever, all right? That's not going to happen again. That was a rare occurrence. <laughs> All right, that was a mistake that I didn't know I could make. Now that I know that's a mistake I can make, I won't make it again. That's how you. That's how. That's how you improve. That is my. That's my whole philosophy. The way you improve is you make mistakes and then you learn from those mistakes and then you just don't do them anymore. It's that easy. Good. At least you're getting more practice, so you get the one CC easier with the other ones. I mean, you can probably first try Marissa and Reynu, maybe Sanaru, you get second try it or something. Right, but then the difficulty is going to come from getting all of the all the second endings, right? So maybe that's going to make that's going to make these one CCs kind of anticlimactic, you know. You keep getting hit on stage two? Dude, you don't know what you're talking about. Watch me, all right? I'm not gonna take any hits on stage two. Watch this, watch this, all right? Kyoko's not gonna step on me, all right? She's not gonna shoot me in the face. Well, she might shoot me in the face, but she won't shoot me from the side. I've got my eyes peeled, all right? I'm gonna, I'm gonna have one eye looking in one place and the other eye will be looking at Kyoko. <laughs> Chileon? What does that mean? <laughs> okay. Oh, here we go. Don't step on me. Don't you dare. Then don't stop trying to sniff her feet. I'm not i I'm not trying to sniff her feet. What do you what do you I'm I'm trying to get spirit points, dude. 
She's a dog. You don't need to get this many spirits, probably. So you can play a little safer, especially since you already got a really good runner here. <sighs> I just want to be ultra safe, okay? I just want to be ultra safe when I when I get to Miko. Not I obviously I'm not being ultra safe right now, but when I get to Miko, I want to have you know, make I want to have as many resources as I can get. And this is how you do it. Chameleon. Oh, that's what that's what Kevin was trying to type. <sighs> All right, this is do this is looking pretty good. If I can get spirit spirits on, I think two of Kyoko's attacks here will be golden. And that's aimed at me. I just now learned that. Ooh, shit. Oh, she almost stepped on me again, dude. Holy crap. <laughs> Kyoko really likes stepping on people, dude. She like she like goes up high on the screen and then whenever when the spell ends she teleports to the bottom of the screen. Well not really, but that's how it feels. Okay, please don't step on me. I'm, I'm, I'm begging you. Okay. How close am I? Okay. Pretty close. I'm almost there. Don't step on me. I'm, I'm begging you, please. Okay. Alright. Okay, good. Alright, alright, perfect. No more, no more funny business. We got another run going, boys! Look at that. See? I proved you wrong. No, no death on stage two. <laughs> Good, now... Don't try to prove me wrong by trying to no miss into Miku again. Just get the run <laughs> you have to get. <laughs> Like, I won't be impressed, I'll just think you're super irresponsible. Oh, right. Hmm. No, listen, look. I just took a shower. I My mind is as fresh as my body now. I- what the fuck am I saying? The, um... I- so Ooh. I- <laughs> Dude! No! Listen, I- I am able- to... I don't know where I was going with that. Let's just keep going. There will be no screaming, Kevin. Only success from here on out.
Oh, if I get far scream, then then you'll be back. Oh, you so you want me to scream to get you to come back? Mm. I see, I see. So you want me to scam you? That's what it is. Or you just or you just want me to scream again, which I guess also works. What do you like getting ear raped? Like, is that is. It, that that must be Kevin's fetish, getting ear raped. Oh gosh. Uh, excuse me. If the run's good, scream. It's good! This is a good run! Get back! Now! Let's go! This is gonna be the one. I can taste it. I have a good sense of these things. I know when 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 we're gonna have a good run. Good, don't disappoint the audience. Oh! I almost died. <laughs> Why did she shoot? I, that, I never see that. Wow. She didn't die. Okay, that's cool. I don't mind timing that out. It's fine. I don't like having to use a bomb there, but again, it's fine. Better use a bomb than to die, but no funny business. I I have an abundance of resources Ugh. at my disposal. I can afford to use them. The only time I need to not use them, they're basically useless when, when I get to you. Uh, Miko, so I might as well use them. I guess. I hate this spell, dude. Runs good! We made it to stage four! Mmm!
Okay, let's see. Ooh. Oh gosh. Alright, I have trans, this is good. I, I can't afford to die, if I die I lose trans. But I just realized that's another reason not to die. Okay, cool. Perfect. Perfect. Okay. Nice. Nice. I'm keeping my eyes peeled. Perfect. All right. We're doing good, guys. This continues to be a no-miss run. We're going... Uh, hopefully I don't die in this stage, but at, even if I do, the run will live on. Dying here would not be catastrophic. Especially because, yes, I just used my trans, so dying would not be catastrophic. Woo! Fammy, this is going to be the one! We're finally going to be done! <laughs> Yay, just please remember not to flipping bomb. <laughs> okay, I won't, I won't. Well, not, not on Miko. I will bomb here. I need to make sure my finger's on the bomb button here. But when I get to Miko, like, my finger needs to be off the bomb button forever and ever. to use all resources at my disposal for now. Ooh, that was a good bomb. That was a good bomb. I would have liked for it to come a little sooner, but my reaction time's a little slow, but that's okay, at least it came out. I might have to bomb this, because I didn't mean to kill Yoshika, and now this is gonna be like ultra bad. Okay, yeah. It didn't touch me, but, yeah, you know, good bombs anyway. Alright. Still no miss! Still no miss! Look at this! 
<laughs> I'm telling you, dude, that break did a lot for me. I'm like, my mind is good now. All is all is good. <laughs> Maybe it's the food and 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 being hydrated too. Mm mm. Let's go. But now we have stage five, and stage five concerns me a little bit. Especially since I don't have any bombs. But, we should be fine. It concerns me because I don't know if I'm gonna be able to build up- If I'm gonna be able- If I die, I lose all my trans. So, that's- that's kind of subpar. Ooh, I might be able to get my trans up here though. Okay, cool. All right, all right. Never mind. We got our trans. This is good. Perfect. All right. Yeah, this is a good run going. <laughs> I mean, I don't see this going wrong unless unless I bomb. Yeah. Unless I bomb on Nico stupidly. <laughs> That's, which is, you know, always a possibility. I could always do that. Okay, okay. It's so... She's... Soga spawns so quickly in this stage. It's really annoying. I wish she didn't spawn so fast. Yeah, but she spawns based on the music cue. Well, yeah, but... She spawns so soon after the last enemies. So it's like... I should just plant a bomb here, like honestly, it's not worth my time. I do have a bomb. I'm just gonna plant it right there. Oh, and I have another bomb. Nice. I didn't mean to- Ah! Oh, it scared me. I guess it's better to use a bomb than lose a life, but now I'm probably going to lose trans to this. Yo, that was that was amazing! Holy, yeah, that was good. Yeah, holy good stage five. That was like almost a flawless stage five, minus the accident. Well, minus the bomb that I I had to that I did because I tried to squeeze in a gap that I probably shouldn't have. Holy crap, dude! Yeah, this is going good. Just don't mess up. Miko again. I mean, in a sense, it's good to get more playtime because, you know, you get better for when you need to get better. So, you know, it's not a complete loss. It makes up for some practice later down the line. I guess, because I heard Sanai is not great, and if I have to do this with Sanai, then I don't know. Depends on how bad Sanai is. <clears throat> Uh, well, just do her absolute last, and it won't be a big deal. Sanai, Sanai, Sanai uh, one CC with three bombs left will still be way easier than DDC crap shot one CCs. Would it? Would it? Would it? Um, Sanai th with three bombs in the pocket be easier than Marissa B one CC UFO? Yes. Yes. Okay. All right. Woo. Absolutely. <laughs> She's not that bad. Okay. Alright, wish me luck. Yeah, just go on. I, do I have bombs? I, mean, I do. I believe in you. I, if, if you don't believe in yourself, I don't care. I think you're wrong if you don't. 
Oh, I believe in myself. I, I think I think after losing one run already, like this this has to be the one. I just don't see how this this fails. As well, I don't see either, but I couldn't see the other run failing. You failed it yourself. Oh dang! It's okay though. It, it I don't I'm I shouldn't expect to capture this. Whatever funny skate boat spell. The spell is funny. You can misdirect the very first wave, which is what you can do for elements. But I wouldn't recommend you going for it. That seems a little too funny for normal. For normal 1cc. I had to focus there because, wow, that was some pretty serious micro dodging I had to do. I don't have any bombs, and I'm at five bomb pieces. I need to keep keep track of that. Since I don't have any bombs, that means I have to take a little bit of risk. No, if you don't have any bombs, then all, all stops are pulled. That's that's when you don't have bombs. That's good for your dodging skill. It means you can dodge without worry of losing bombs. Yeah, I don't have to worry about like making sure that I'm not taking too much risk like oh is this too much risk should I use a bomb I could just go I can just fo focus purely on dodging anyway this should no miss well I wouldn't count it I I would not mind dying here because this yeah, is but this one is easy enough I mean it does that's not a problem if you die here but it, it, this one is easy enough. If I had a bomb, I would use it. If if I if I was in the slightest danger, unfortunately, I don't. So I have to really focus. Good, you don't. So you know, just dodge. Just dodge because you you can. All right. There it is, and it looks like we're going to get to six lives again. So hey. <laughs> um. Oh, yeah. Hmm. Six out of eight. Is it safe for me to grab bomb pieces? I don't know. Uh. Uh. I. I. I, I don't know. I, I don't, mean. I don't think it is. Maybe if you if you die somewhere on stage six, you could you could get the bomb pieces and then get to free, kinda, maybe, I don't know, you could maybe just get the life pieces on stage 6. We'll have to see. I don't know, we'll, we'll, we'll see. Yeah, maybe don't get the bomb pieces, but get the life pieces. Well, I'm not but gonna get the 18 them. life, and Miko's gonna give me enough life pieces to secure my next life. The 18 life one is just if you're if you really freaking route the the thingies. Uh, that that's basically just for scoring. All right. There's four, I can do it. I'll get I'll get enough. We're at two. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, that's good. And the life piece. Here we go. Perfect! This is it! This is it! Now I just have to not bomb on Mika's last two spells, and I have to make sure that I take a death before her final spell. <laughs> yeah. Oh. All right. Just take the death when you're about to get the, the spell before you get the life piece, maybe? 
or two spells rather, but that would be maybe safer. Yeah. Just just play the freaking thing and don't bomb this time. Let's go. Just remember not to touch the freaking bomb button. You don't need it. You, you really don't. Don't even use the bomb you already have. No, I'm gonna use, I'm gonna, I can use the bomb I already have for this spell. This spell sucks. It sucks, yes. But you know, you might as well count this as a no bomb run so you lose the mentality of using the freaking bomb. Well, you used it anyway. I, it's not worth taking. I'm losing a life over that one. If I'm gonna lose a life, I'm gonna lose my lives to the penultimate spell. Or to some BS. Come on. I don't have any lives, or I don't have any bombs, so I have to do this. Okay. How many pieces am I at? Okay. Yeah, we're good. Make sure I get this bomb piece. Okay, cool. Yeah, whatever. Happens. Oh god, these girls move so slowly on normal here. Uh, dude, uh, are you sure you right. can use the bomb? Whatever. Yeah, I'm sure I can use it. But drop the freaking habit before you do it again. Alright, I'm done using bombs now. That's it. It's not even as if you don't have life to spare. Ow! That's not where I wanted to take a death. You have the life to spare. Ow! No, I don't! You're dying to rush in my team, maybe. Fuck it. Just, 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 just bomb through this. I'll even bomb through this one as well. Or not. Okay. I did. Okay! We're here! We're here! This is it! No more bombs! No more bombs! And I'm probably gonna take a death. And even if I don't, then I have to- I have to take another death. Okay. There's one. Go, 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 go. This one looks great pretty solved already, but you know, just, just close to the end, but you still need the coast. Oh god, I'm at low power. I did not consider being at low power. Here it is! This is it! This is it, guys! Don't touch the bomb button! Do not touch the bomb button! I mean, that sounds pretty easy, doesn't it? I mean, you don't even need to. You you have three lives. Let's go! Come on! This is it! This is it! This is the one! Uh oh. Oh god. I just fucked up the pattern. Okay. Whatever you have. Come life. on! Come on! We got this! We got this! Come on! We got this! Ah! It doesn't matter! She's dead! I have two lives! Let's go! Let's go! Oh, man.
and you're allowed. <laughs> yeah! All right, this better be an amazing alternate ending, dude. Like for real. Like, <laughs> what is it? Okay, this I did not see. What is this, dude? <laughs> <laughs> what? Why did not- This was not in the- uh, This was definitely not in the other ending. What is this? With the Yuyuko with the mustache? What the fuck? <laughs> this is Yomu. Oh, Yomu, I'm sorry. I, I said the wrong one. <laughs> they both start with Y. What is this? <laughs> what? Ho, ho, ho! She's Santa Claus! It's oh, too early for this, Yomu. We still got Thanksgiving first. Oh, even Yomu. Yomu doing thank doing December before doing Thanksgiving. <laughs> Good, we don't celebrate Thanksgiving here anyway. <laughs> well, I live in America, and we sur we sur we survive Thanksgiving. We celebrate Thanksgiving. <laughs> Look, at I like how she how Zoom points to the half spirit over there. Hey, wait, is that if that is she sitting on top of her half spirit? Is that what that is? Yeah. Why is it so? Why is it so uh, fuzzy? Yeah, but I guess it's because she's squishing it. You live in Merka and you don't celebrate Thanksgiving. Well, what is Yomu doing? Why does she have a mustache? She's meditating. Is it... <laughs> what the fuck, dude? This is so funny. <laughs> I need somebody who knows their shit when it comes to Toho lore. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, and yes, despite the fact that I, I tacitly admit I never read the dialogue, I do know what's in it. You do know what's in it? So you know what this ending is? Even though you didn't even know these endings existed? No, I don't know what's in this ending, but I do vaguely know what they're talking about in the cutscenes and stuff. Oh, okay. But how did she come to understand that she's a hermit just because she has three bombs in her in her pocket? Also, I, I, I need to know... How did Zune how how did Zune expect people to figure this out? That you needed I don't know. that you that you get this ending for that there's a secret ending in this game. I don't know. Yeah, I mean I don't know. I mean if you didn't know Bomb Run, you'd get it. True. And people and people would have done no bomb runs of this game day one. I got I got LMB on Toho 19 day one. What? You mean Lunatic No Bomb on day yeah. one on the yeah. newest Toho game? Yeah. That was a shoot 'em up. Yeah. It it that game must be easy then. <laughs> uh, yeah, it's kind it's kind of easy, but I also have LNN in it. Toho nineteen is free. Yeah, I've heard that the demo or not the demo. I I was reading chat. I I've heard that the um. That the gimmick in that game is really busted. If you understand how Toho 19 works, it is a very easy game, kinda. So uh, some people just don't understand how to play that game at all, and and they can't do shit in it, for lack of better words. But yeah, it, it is a, an easy game if you know what you're doing. Hmm. Easy kinda, you know. Kinda like some training animism. Ending number eight. You're so cruel, you lady. You go. Now I have to ask, wh are all of the endings canon, or like, are the parallel endings canon, or which which one is canon? I, I mean, the I Toho love canon. This. I mean, the Toho canon kind of seems to move on regardless of the ending, so there's probably not really like a canon ending. Sometimes the mangas end up confirming that like, an one of the end, at least one of the endings happened, but you know. It, 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 the fact that it confirms one of the endings happens doesn't mean, you know, that some of the others didn't. Uh, I mean, depending on the game, more than one of the endings we know is canon. So, for, for example, in UFO, probably all the endings are canon. But, but for example, for DDC, I know what one of the Marissa endings contradicts one of the Rainbow endings. And we know the rainbow ending is canon, so we know at least one of those Marissa endings is not canon, for example. Okay. This is the parallel ending! Congratulations! Yes! We did it! 
Are you gonna attempt other shot types today? Yeah, why not? I mean, now that I did that, I mean, I ought to do Reimu on my first try, yeah? I can take a death on stage two and still do it first try. <laughs> I could literally have the worst run ever and beat it with Reimu. Well, it depends. How, how good is Reimu? Oh, this, this, uh, this is, uh, the stage four theme. I guess Zune really liked the stage four theme, just like I did. It's the stage four theme, but in a different key. Yeah, the, this actually becomes like a running... F I think every single ending theme in Toho starting with this game is a, is a remix of one of the stage themes. It's so good. I like it because stage four was my favorite theme. In this game. The What's more a lot of people. Huh? It's the most popular one from this from this game. Yeah, it was always was. And it is especially nowadays because there's a meme song attached to it. Oh? What's Oh, I, you got to you got to send that to me in the Discord, man. <laughs> bum 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 bum. Now, Clown Piece, is, is Clown Piece widely known in the community because she's absolutely ridiculous and normal? Or is there, was there like a meme that took off that helped, that helped boost her popularity? I, I, I guess for, it's, it's twofold. First of all, her freaking design. And second, it's because, it's because most people play on normal and she's stupid on normal. Look at that. Oh, I, I even beat my high score. Hey. I mean, it's pretty hard to not beat your high score when you're no missing, or, or you know, or when you're gathering resources. All right, look at that. Wow! Look, oh my god, it took 11 days for me to do that. But that's but that's only because I I had to take a week off to do IRL shit. <laughs> or. Also, anyway, you can probably get both Marissa and Ray move first, right? 